With the stroke of a pen, Lockheed Martin is getting back into commercial aviation. Orlando, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Worldwide Air Transport Company, ASL Aviation, has signed a letter of intent to purchase 10 of the new LM100J freighters, a commercial variant of the C-130J Super Hercules. Lockheed Martin and ASL made the announcement at this year's Farnborough Air Show in England. The first L-100 Hercules went to work for Alaska Airlines in early 1965. The LM-100J is an updated version of the L-100 freighter. From the mid-1960s to early 1990s, Lockheed Martin produced more than 100 of this reliable plane, which is still being used around the world to support a variety of missions, from humanitarian aid to supporting oil and mining operations. ASL Aviation has been operating C-130s for over 40 years, and its associated company, Safair, currently operates one of the world's largest L-100 fleets out of South Africa. The new LM-100Js will continue and enhance the company's efforts around the world. For more than four decades, Safair crews have taken L-100s where others didn't think airplanes could go. And now with the arrival of the LM-100J, Safair crews will continue to take Hercules around the globe for many more years to come. The LM-100J will be deployed in the most difficult and distressing circumstances bringing humanitarian aid and relief to those suffering most around the world. The new LM-100J Hercules will also have an imp Im immensely important role for oil spill, especially as oil exploration goes away from the traditional areas. In other words, into the Arctic areas and other remote aspects of the world where uh, oil exploration needs to, to be developed. ASL will use its new LM100Js to replace its current fleet of L100s. The LM100J program is part of the C-130J program and all LM100Js will be built in Marietta, Georgia, home to the Hercules production line.